many civilizations have risen, flowered and decayed since man first walked the earth. But of all those that have contributed to the story of mankind, there's none more fascinating than that of ancient Egypt. The remains of its past glory are still there, stretching along 800 miles of the Nile. It's been said, the ancient Egyptians built like men 50 feet high, so huge are their works. But when we try to put a date to them, we discover a remarkable thing. The first pyramid, the Step Pyramid of Saqqara, was built 2,750 years before Christ. The Temple of Horus at Edfu wasn't completed until 80 BC. In other words, these building activities went on for nearly 3,000 years. It's impossible to look at these remains without wondering what these people were like who achieved so much so long ago. Fortunately, they've left a wealth of evidence to help us answer that question. For these temples are like so many vast books of stone. Every surface has been employed by the sculptors. Such exciting events as the discovery of the tomb of Tutankhamun as recently as 1922, his body still lying beneath the golden mask, added greatly to our knowledge. Furniture and exquisitely made articles of all kinds were found in greater quantities than ever before, for this was the only royal tomb which hadn't been stripped by robbers. Perhaps nowhere else would they have survived in such an excellent state of preservation as in Egypt. For Egypt, with its blue skies and sandy deserts, has a climate so dry that it dehydrates and therefore preserves. And just as it preserved the furniture in the tombs, so it enabled the countless paintings that cover the walls of the tombs and temples to survive for as long as 5,000 years. To this dry climate, we owe to the preservation of innumerable papyri, the earliest form of writing material made from the stems of the papyrus plant. And wonderfully preserved many of them are. But what do these hieroglyphs, one of the earliest forms of writing, found in such profusion on the papyri, tablets and temple walls, what do they mean?